Hello everyone. So in today's video, we are going to see how to clean your C drive on Windows 11. So let's start with our first tip. Right click on Windows icon. Then click on this option settings. Now on the left side, click on this system option. After that on the right side, click on this storage option. Now in storage management, you will see this option cleanup recommendations. Click on it. Now at the top, you will see this option temporary files. Take this option. So these are the temporary files you have in your system. Then click on this option cleanup and this will also show you the size of your temporary files. Click on it. Click on continue. And after that, uh, you can see this option unused apps. So this will show you the unused app on your system. So if you want to uninstall any application, you can do it from here. Simply take this option. And after that, click on this option clean up. Okay. Now move on to the next step and go back to the storage option. Now here, click on this option temporary files. So this will show you all the temporary files you have in your system. Now tick this option, tick all the options. Uh, if you have multiple options, tick all the options. After that, click on this option, remove files. So this will remove all the temporary files from your system. Click on it. Click on continue. After that, go back. And now Enable this storage sense option. So this will automatically free up the space and delete all the temporary files from your system automatically. So enable this option. Okay. Now cut this window. Now move on to the next step. Run the disk cleanup. Click on this windows icon. After that, click on this search, uh, search box and type disk cleanup. Click on this option disk cleanup. Now select the C drive, then click on OK. After that, click on this option clean up system files. Click on OK. Now tick all the options. Okay, tick all the options like this. So these are the temporary files and unnecessary files in your system. Tick all the options. After that, click on OK. Click on delete files. So this will delete all the temporary uh, files from your system. And this will also delete the files from your recycle bin as well. Now move on to the next step. Remove all the unused applications and games from your system. Right click on Windows icon. Then click on this settings option. Now on the left side, click on this apps option. After that, on the right side, you will get this options, apps and features. Click on it. Now here you can see in the app list. These all are the applications you have or you are using in your system. So uninstall if there is any unnecessary application or game in your system. To uninstall any application, simply click on these three dots and after that click on uninstall. So this will uninstall the unnecessary or unused uh, application or game from your system. This will also help you to free up the space from your C drive. Now move on to the next step. If you have unnecessary uh, login user accounts in your system, you can delete them as well. I will show you first. So I have uh, two login accounts in my system. I will show you the both. So if I lock my system. And here you can see I have two login uh, user accounts. So this, the, uh, this is the account uh, which I can delete. This is uh, not necessary. So I will show you how to delete the second user account uh, in your system. So what you have to do is uh, right click on windows icon, then click on this settings option. 
Now on the left side, click on this accounts option. After that, on the right side, click on this option family and other users. And here you will see this option. So this is my second login user account, which I'm not using. So I can delete this and this will also help me to free up the space uh, in my C drive. Click on remove. So this will remove this account and the data. If there is any data in this accounts desktop, this will delete the account and data both, but this will not impact in your current login user account. Okay. I will show you how to do it. Simply click on remove. So this will ask you to delete the account and data. Click on yes, click on it. And you can see the account has been deleted. And this will not impact anything uh, uh, in your current login user account. So these are the few things you can apply to clean up the C drive on Windows 11. This is all for the video. Thank you.